natin ang basketball vlogger na si Nico Baguio para alamin kung Team Lebron ba siya o Team Kobe ba siya. Did you take a pick or did, did you let the numbers decide? Anong, anong tinignan mo dyan? Well, iba kasi yung usapan kapag uh, numer- statistical analysis yung ginawa. Mm. Kasi a lot of people will say, although statistically, Lebron is better talaga. As in, there's no question about it. Mm-mm. Kapag pinag-usapan lang yung... Um, plus bo- uh, adjusted plus minus right. si mga other advanced stats na alam natin um, LeBron is actually better talaga pero okay. we all know that's not everything there is to know about basketball and Correct. tsaka yung setting na sinet na ano one on one kasi hmm. which is yung biggest question it's Kung a one on one one on one ibang usapan yun okay. um, for me uh, i would pick reluctantly hmm. ano to prime ah and uh. Siguro, Pri- correct. Prime yeah. nila, yeah. by the way. Prime. By the way, wow. prime. Um, I think yung first discussion muna is what would be yung prime ng bawat isa. Yeah, when would that be? Would you, yeah. Kasi both, I think, are beyond their prime. Obviously, Kobe is beyond their, his prime. But mm-hmm. would you say LeBron is fastest prime already by now? Uh, yeah, he's, okay. he's fastest prime. Mm-hmm. And it's not, hindi naman nakakahiyang sabihin yun na mm-hmm. fastest prime na yeah. siya. When Old, was prime for him? How many years ago? Yung prime kasi, yung definition kasi ng prime usually yung mga players or at least most people agree is that mm-hmm. it's, Iba kasi yung physical prime yep. and yung e- prime yung dun sa experience. Correct. Okay, kasi yun. mas madiskarte ka na, ka na, mas matalino ka na. Yeah. Correct. All those so, things. So, all those things. Usually, yung physical prime mo, it reaches around 24. Yeah. Okay. So, usually, dun talaga pinakamaganda yung performance mo physically. Mm-hmm. Um, that's when, usually, dun yung pinaka-breakout talaga ng bawat players. Um, that's when LeBron had his first 27 uh, seven seven season. Okay. Tasi Carmelo dun yun nag breakout shot sa Denver twenty five. Okay. Bosch, all the recent superstars and mm-hmm. actually even if you look back, usually nag peak sila physically around twenty three and twenty four. But at twenty four, LeBron was still suffering in Cleveland. When I say suffering, uh, didn't win a title yet. Yeah. Uh, be before he and then some would say maybe his prime would be his MVP yeah. and championship year yeah. in Miami. Because grab yeah. yung IQ. Yung. Uh, not physical prime mm. ni LeBron, I think, is yung um, championship year niya sa Miami. Mm. Right after he lost to Dallas. So the they lost to Dallas. Yeah. Against OKC. First, yeah, against OKC. Dun mo mm. talaga makikita yung parang sobrang mm. dominant niya to the point na he actually played around with OKC, which at that time, mm. if I remember correctly, was actually the favorites to win yung um, the title. Title, okay, ba? Yeah. Um, for throughout the season, kahit na meron silang minor injuries here and there, mm. yun yung last season kung kailan healthy yung tatlo. Right. And uh, nandun pa si James Harden. Harden so, there, kumbaga, yun yung there, parang... Uh, and at that time, talaga, Thunder yung very, very um, uh, heavily favored. Right, and right, LeBron right. actually toyed with them. So, Anong yun? meron si LeBron Prime during that year that he was MVP season and the finals? Kung kumbaga, he was champion. calmer. He uh, didn't... Uh, he posted a lot and dun mo talaga makikita yung parang experience niya. Before kasi pag nasa post siya, usually he just bully his way. Pero no, at that time, if you watch him, usually hindi siya kaagad galaw eh. Usually, tingin muna or before pa that, meron na siyang naisip siguro. Yeah, Correct, even before receiving yeah. the ball, binabasa na. Nababasa niya na ganun. Um, for Kobe naman, most of the people will say na yung physical prime niya was yung 35 yung season na nag average 35 points okay. that was around i think 26 siya okay lebron 24 mm-hmm. and then yun yung talagang nobody could stop him at all yun yung mm-hmm. time na he was actually one of the last player to set yung record ng 50 point game straight wow. uh, five five was games it, was since it the same season of the 81 points yeah same was, season of 81 was, points yeah. and yung 60 62.3 okay. quarters okay. So, yun talaga yung physical prime niya, for me mm-hmm. at least. Pero yung um, prime niya talaga, as in not physical prime, yeah. pero yung prime prime niya, right. is yung um, championship niya versus Boston. Okay. With Shaq? Dede. Uh, or with Gasol? Yung, with Gasol. Ah. Yun yung, yung isa mga uh, series na pinagayabang ng Boston na if Kendrick Perkins was not injured. Ah. So, this is title number four? Yeah, title right? number four. Yeah, because he won three with um, I think yun yung, yung prime niya talaga. Kasi, again, same dun sa kay Lebron. Mm-hmm. Dun na siya naging madiskarte. And right. he wasn't uh, physically, kumbaga, hindi pa siya ganun ka-deteriorate mm-hmm. yung physical abilities niya. Oh, to yeah, the point na, good. yeah, yun yung may dunk siya over kay Garnett. Correct, correct. Um, yeah. face, uh, poster dong na kay mm-hmm. Garnett. Um, so I think if we had to ask 
physical prime to phys- physical prime to physical prime. Talo talaga si Kobe doon. Okay. Definitely. Dahil sa just physical yeah, brute physical strength. Yeah, physical talaga kasi LeBron yung bata oh. sa bat- ano. Pero kung itatapat natin yung, yung prime isang prime. prime, yung prime prime, parang karne. <laughs> prime prime prime. <laughs> Those championship yeah. um, years when they I think it's were Kobe. Kasi Kobe, okay. one thing that stuck to me nung time na yun, nung sobrang big thing ni Kobe is that yung isang quote about asking yung competitiveness ni Kobe. And isa sa mga drills na ginagawa nila nung time na yun is that mag one on one sila sa post. Okay. Definitely yun kasi magiging advantage ni LeBron, physical yeah. advantage. And oh. yung isa daw sa mga pinakainaabangan ng mga ng Lakers staff nun is yung one on one ni Pau Gasol, mm-hmm. which at that time was also in his prime prime. Yep. And si Kobe. Mm-hmm. And ang sagot lang ng mga tao is that Kobe was actually eating Gasol's wow. lunch. So parang ganun daw ka dinodome. And oh. Gasol is already 6'10 sa post daw to. Um, yeah. Hindi siya parang off the dribble. Uh-oh. So I think doon mo makikita kung gano'n ka different yung approach nila na mm-hmm. si Kobe talaga kahit may physical advantage ka, he'll try to find a way to outsmart you, mm-hmm. to outmaneuver you. Mm-hmm. Kahit na si Lebron to pa, who's actually one of the be- right. best, greater players in the league. Okay. Well, um, from this whole matchup that we've seen, uh, how how robbed are we of a chance to see them in the finals? How great would yeah. that have been? But but would they have seen each other in their prime prime? Because the prime prime of LeBron was in Miami, and people wanted to see Miami versus LA, but was Kobe still there? Yung, yun nga, uh, yung last, yung final season talaga na dapat na nangyari yun mm-hmm. is 27-2008. Yun okay. yung uh, Cleveland, Cleveland versus Spurs, right. and then yung 28-09, uh, yung nagset yung Cleveland ng 62, yung franchise best nila, mm-hmm. and um, hindi sila nakapasok all the way to the finals, right. natalo sila sa Orlando. Okay. Um, yeah, we were definitely robbed, kasi yun yung sakto yun eh, mm-hmm. yun yung right about papasok na dun sa Sayan. prime prime si LeBron, oh. and then nasa prime prime na si Kobe, okay. and oh, sobrang sayang kasi I'm going to guess they would have matched well, and yeah. we could have actually seen yung battle na hinahanap natin ngayon right. dun sa finals na yun dapat. And you know, the last time we saw something like that was Magic Bird yeah, Magic in Bird. their prime. Yeah. Like the two, you know, dominant teams in the East and the West. Okay, what can the younger players learn from what these two have done so far? Of course, LeBron's not yet done, uh, but with Kobe and LeBron, anong matututunan ng mga younger players out there? I mean, of course, the game's changed so much. It's not how well these two dominated in their prime, but yeah. anong, nat- anong makukuha nila dun? Well, it's at this point, kumbaga, Ang, ang hirap sabihin, pero karamihan na ng mga stars kaya mas bata na sa akin. <laughs> Which I could never say before. Tumatanda ka na rin. Yeah. You don't stop growing. Um, <laughs> I think yung sa, la, sa dami na stories na makikita mo about, uh-huh. or mababasa mo and mga videos na makikita mo about kay Lebron and kay hmm. Kobe, I think one of the things na mapupula talaga ng mga younger players is that the thing that separates superstars from stars hmm. is not actually ability. Okay. Um, okay. A lot of players, lahat naman na nasa NBA, they have ability. Yep. The one thing that separates them is that yung mga superstars, they know how to grind. Mm. And one of the things na sinasabi pa natin ng mga coaches at that time na quote always mm-hmm. is that um, you want players that know that they don't love the grind, yep. but they still do it. They still do it. Because so, you know, they know that's what will get them there yeah. and will bring the team there. All right. Well, uh, hanggang YouTube na lang tayo. <laughs> we want to reminisce more Kobe versus Or mga LeBron. edits. <laughs> or edits. Or just do it on 2K. <laughs> but uh, it was a treat to see them both. Kaito Pano, they went up against other in the regular season. Uh, even the All-Stars. And now today was a great game. So Nico, maraming salamat. Uh, chat with him as well on Twitter if you want to discuss more about this. Who's prime, prime, or prime review you choose? Prime. Nico Baguio on Twitter. Thank you. Salamat. Thank you. For more sports updates, keep watching The Score and don't forget to subscribe.